Mr. Chrissy, Dave Zobeck. I'm here from Restory. Can okay. I check your ID? Sure. Okay. Um, I'm going to be giving you a little bit different uh, breathing treatment than what you've had before. We're going to give you the nebulized medications, but we're now going to add a device that's going to help inflate your lungs, hold them open so that you can bring secretions up easier. Okay? okay. Is that something my doctor wanted? Yes, it's uh, yeah, ordered, good. and we'll be doing that with every the, one of the nebulized medication treatments. Okay, whatever. Okay. Let me get my stuff together, and then I'll explain what we're going to do. Okay, the assembly of the EasyPAP system is we have the nebulizer with the, uh, the T in the mouthpiece and the flex tube as normally delivered. Easy pad fits at the end of the flex tube. The pressure or the flow continues up to the top or middle nipple. And then this connector is for your anometer gauge. So you have the system that has a manometer gauge, your flow to uh, operate the easy pad, and your nebulizer. If you're going to use a, a mask, take the flow me the mouthpiece off and attach a mask at that point. So you've been having a lot of uh, problems with secretions. Yeah, feel it in there, just can't get them out. Okay. Uh, coughing anything up? Uh, it's loose but dry. Okay. okay. Very good. Have your nebulizer here. This is the device we call PEP. And we're going to watch the pressure with this manometer. Okay. okay. And we have your medication and the saline, uh, just like what you were getting prior. Let me uh, assemble all of this. We now have two tubings of gas, one to operate the pressure and one to nebulize the medications. Okay. And okay. A lot of junk there, huh? Yeah, little pieces to put together. Here's your albuterol. I'm going to save that to uh, scan it into the chart later. Okay. And use the unit of saline. I just do it like normal, like my other treatments? That's right. As okay. soon as I turn it on, and, okay, and I'm going to uh, start turning up the pressure that you'll feel. How's that feel? Okay. Okay. I'm giving you uh, about five 
pressure. This little uh, guy here will kind of explain a little bit how this works um, in the event we send you home with it. It feels the same when I breathe in, when I'm breathing out, it's different, is that? Right. Okay. So it's going to help hold your lungs open on exhalation. While you're doing that, I'm going to take a pulse. And I'm going to take a listen to your breath sounds. Listen first here. Okay. It feels the same when I breathe in, when I'm breathing out, it's different, is that? Right. Okay. So it's going to help hold your lungs open on exhalation. While you're doing that, I'm going to take a pulse. And I'm going to take a listen to your breath sounds. Listen first here. You lean forward a little bit. Okay, good. Just a little bit more. Feel okay? Mm -hmm. Feel dizzy or a little discomfort anywhere? Mm -hmm. Okay. Fifteen, ten minutes have gone by. Okay. Treatment's done. Now, let me turn this all off. How's that feel? Like, have something to cough out? Uh, it feels a little loose, such. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay. It's good. Yeah, I was able to swallow a little bit. Yeah. You're a little bit. You may see in the next 10, 15 minutes more secretions loosening up. Okay. Um, you have some uh, Kleenexes? Yeah, they're on my stand around the okay. other side there. There you go. Okay. And trying to give me another big cough. <coughs> okay. Good. Good. All right. Yep. Thank you. Take Thank care. you. I'll put this stuff all the way. And that's four times a day still, I think, yes. we were doing them? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, all right. Uh, we also have a PRN order, so if you get, uh, feel like you need some, give okay. us a call. We'll take a look and see if it uh, would be beneficial. Okay. okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank Let me you. Clean up the stuff. And I'm just going to chart. Okay. Good. All right, thanks. Thank you. Okay. Did I miss anything? No. Therapy without nebulization. Simply attach the mouthpiece to the end of the easy pep. You'll notice the end of the easy pep has a uh, riffled or a wavy end. It's also the end that the mouthpiece will not fit onto. This is the exhalation end. 
the smaller end is the mouthpiece end.